Long ago, when light and darkness still bore life, the goddess emerged from the light, and an entity known as the Vile God burst forth from the darkness. fierce battle ensued between the deities. The light tore the darkness to shreds. The darkness corroded the light. And eventually, both sides lost their spark of life. And so, the goddess and the vile god fell into a deep, eternal slumber, like a dying star emitting a final burst of light before imploding into darkness. Nice to meet you, Thing. That sword belongs to you now, and with it, my power is yours as well. That sword in your hand is just one fury out of a hundred. If you gather all the furies and revive the goddess who has been sealed away with the vile god, your wish will be granted. Uh, I don't know what the hell is going on, but I guess I've got no choice. Watch out, Thing! Fencers have to fight to collect furies, eh? But I think there's more to being a fencer than just fighting. Yeah. Here. So. It's not over yet. My name is Ethel. If we cross paths in hell, I'll kill you then. Prepare yourself, Sigurd. Not yet. Our battle isn't finished just yet. Deliver your final blow and claim my life. All right, it's decided. I shall accompany you and properly instruct you on ethics and morality. Wow, this guy is unbelievably strong. There's no point in forcing yourself and acting all cool if you're just gonna die. There's no way I can run away. I'm the one who decides my fate. Even if I have to will that fate into existence. Pippin, if you believe you possess true justice, then you must see your beliefs through to the end. Hello, 